It is so congested, I'm not kidding. Photographers are just jumping around for vantage points. They tell us, go here. One guy said, go there. Another guy said, get out of here. It's been nuts. The uh, car idea had to be abandoned and I had to take off on foot. And uh, they're leaving me alone here. I'm tucked in behind a car right at the gate, at the main gate. And you are looking at the SN8 bearing with the canards and the uh, They got Coney Z in place. Uh, I'm sure it's a Tankzilla also. Uh, but today, she's going to lift the, the cone. The carrying. It's a beautiful day on the tip of Texas. Gorgeous. Nice breeze. Getting a little kiss of sun on our cheeks. Not too hot. If you get hot, you just step around the corner and get in the breeze. I'm looking due west almost. Pretty good hump day for SpaceX. I was reading a surmise of all the activity that's happened last week, this week, and to come, and they gotta have somebody telling Elon which way to get up and go. I mean, it's just nuts with SpaceX with so much, I'd say, positive activity, everything that, uh, has happened, they've handled with grace and and uh, struggling through it without blinking an eye. I just, I've learned a lot from watching SpaceX out my bedroom window. So I was telling my sister this morning, who's a nurse and uh, working with a lot of patients that are totally stressed out with the COVID. And I told her, I said, just show them my YouTube channel and tell them to look forward to the future. Tell them that there's going to be a lot to look forward to and get them excited about something and help them through their pain. And she said, I can't tell them you're my sister or I'd never get away from the patient's bed. But so anyway, the nurses and her ended up watching the um, static fire on Tuesday night. Tuesday morning. Oh God, I can't remember. I was there Monday night and Tuesday night. So it must have been Tuesday night. I'd swing around and show you the entrance, which is just clogged with uh, earth, uh, with a, um, what do you call those rollers? And, uh, oh, sorry, I was talking to someone else there for a second. Um, lots of uh, security, lots of front loaders panning out. They're really, the very last minute, making this as flat and as hard as they can. Yeah, that earth roller is, I had to bury the legs of my tripod into the sand really hard and I can still feel it vibrating. Well, that guy's a speedy Gonzales. I wouldn't have done that. These guys are risky. Those little um, Kawasaki four-wheel off-road vehicles. Feel that roller? Whew. 
Rumble, rumble. That used to wake me up at 4 a.m. We have workers plopped into their pickup trucks trying to get a good view. They got their live streams going or they've got their cameras rolling. Every time I get in position, somebody parks in front of me. <laughs> <laughs> 